Air in magnetic declination is one of the most common and largest sources of error for an MWD survey. So, what is magnetic declination? Simply put, magnetic declination is how we relate true north and magnetic north to each other. Specifically, magnetic declination is the angle between true north and magnetic north with respect to location and time. So, what is true north and magnetic north? True north, also known as geographic north or the true north pole, is the location in which the Earth's invisible spin axis exits the Earth. You can also think of it as the point where all longitudinal lines converge in the northern hemisphere. This is true north. For magnetic north, think of the Earth as one big magnet, kind of like that of a bar magnet. Therefore, there are magnetic north and south poles. Magnetic north corresponds to the north magnetic pole of the Earth's magnetic field and is the north reference a magnetic compass seeks. Important note, magnetic north migrates over time as the Earth's magnetic field is constantly changing. So, why is magnetic declination important? Magnetic declination is a crucial aspect of survey management when considering measurement wall drilling tools, or MWD tools. This is because these tools rely on magnetic sensors for the measurement of azimuth, and therefore, fundamentally, the tool uses magnetic north as its reference for azimuth. But the story doesn't end there. Once a magnetic azimuth is determined, it immediately needs to be converted to a true north reference azimuth. This is done by adding the corresponding magnetic declination to the magnetic north referenced azimuth, the MWD tool measured. Correct determination of magnetic declination requires a known geographic location and time. This can lead to significant well-bore placement blunders if not done properly. For MWD surveys, converting from a magnetic north azimuth to a true north azimuth is a critical step. But why is that? Well, we never want to reference only magnetic north for MWD surveys because remember, the Earth's magnetic field migrates over time, whereas true north is constant. Failure to account for magnetic declination would mean the MWD surveys are referencing a moving target, that is, magnetic north. This fails over time to represent the wellbore's location accurately. What are the consequences of magnetic declination error? Air in magnetic declination is one of the most common and largest sources of error for an MWD survey. Any error in magnetic declination or gross error in how it's applied leads directly to error in wellbore positioning. Any error in magnetic declination is inherited fully into the computation of the wellbore trajectory. We refer to it as a one-to-one -one error source compounding over the entire trajectory and in the same direction. Determining magnetic declination requires a magnetic model. h and survey management uses ultra-high-resolution magnetic models, including h and IFR1, to determine magnetic declination precisely for a given time and location, with significant error reduction especially when compared with the main field magnetic models. Contact HMP Survey Management to learn more.